the rough. There's Fleet Warrior, and on the inside, it's Karen's Cove. Fleet Warrior, Karen's Cove. Karen's Cove takes an arrow lead. Fleet Warrior is right there in second with Pinkster. Next in third, it's two and a half lengths to Winning Drive, who is running in a fourth. On the outside is a cause of action, and uh, trailing the field is Healy's Hope. Karen's Cove gets away here to lead by three lengths with Fleet Warrior racing in second, the opening quarter mile in 23 seconds. Karen's Cove on the lead here, and the lead is now four lengths, now five. Fleet Warrior running in second. Then it's Pinkster in third. Cause of action. Moving up on the extreme outside. Winning drive is down towards the rail. And farther back it is Healy's Hope as the field comes for the top of the stretch with Karen's Cove, the one to catch. Karen's Cove is in front. Uh, Binkster on the chase in second. Fleet Warrior is dropping back, passed at the rail by Winning Drive. It is Karen's Cove with the lead, Winning Drive, and Binkster. They are right together, second and third. Healy's Hope is putting in a late run. Karen's Cove is in front. The lead is down at two and a half lengths. Here's Winning Drive driving up on the outside. Winning Drive gets up to defeat Karen's Cove. Number one, Winning Drive was first. Number two, Karen's Cove second. Number five, Healy's Hope finished third. And number four, Binkster was fourth. The results unofficial. One, two, five, four. Time of the race, one minute, 13 seconds. Number one is winning drive. Six-year-old Bay Gelding by Flatter out of Lillian Gish by Quiet American. Winning drive owned by Krakow Racing and America's Pastime Stables. Trained by Merkan Cantramasi, the rider Trevor McCarthy. Winning drive was bred in Florida by Haras Buenbornicano.